Hi, Kipsters. Happy Team Tuesday. Get your head in the game and wear your favorite sportswear. So I'm going to give you a few moments, if you didn't get the memo, to go get your favorite jersey or any type of sportswear. Grab a piece of paper and a pencil while you're at it. <clears throat> I hope you're ready. Hope you have your head in the game for CGI today. So I'm going to read this problem three times today. It says, I have 12 blocks. Aiden has nine blocks. How many more blocks do I have than Aiden? I have 12 blocks. Aiden has nine blocks. How many more blocks do I have than Aiden? I'm going to read it one more time. I have 12 blocks. How many blocks does Miss Washington have? 12. Aiden has nine blocks. How many blocks does Aiden have? Just nine. How many more blocks do I have than Aiden? So there are a couple numbers and words that I noticed that is super important to help us solve this problem. So I'm going to circle the number 12 because that's how many blocks I have. I'm also going to circle the number 9 because that's how many blocks Aiden has. And then I'm going to circle the words many more. And I'm also going to circle then. So this problem is a little different. So do you all think that we're going to be adding or subtracting? If you said subtracting, you are correct. So I want you guys to follow along while I draw the pictures today because our picture is just going to be a little different. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw 12 blocks. So I'm going to draw squares to represent the blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12. So now I have 12 blocks. So directly under my blocks, I'm going to write nine blocks for Aiden. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So now the question says, how many more blocks do I have than Aiden? So let's go back and count my blocks again and let's count Aiden blocks again so we can make sure we have the correct 12 and the correct nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So I have 12. Now let's count and make sure that we have Aiden with nine blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now, since we know that the question wants to know how many more blocks do I have than Aiden, and you guys told me that we're going to be doing subtraction, I want you to just follow along and watch how Ms. Washington does it. So I'm going to match our blocks all the way until there's no more to match. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh no, there's no more to match. So now I'm going to count how many more is left. One, two, three. So I know that I have three blocks left and Aiden doesn't have any blocks left. So how many more blocks does Miss Washington have than Aiden? If you said three, you are correct. And friends, I know this was a little different than the others, but don't worry, we'll get more and more practice. So now, since we're doing subtraction, I'm going to do the number senses, and I want you guys to follow along. So I'm going to put 12, which is a one and a two, minus nine, because that's how many Aiden had equals how many was left? Three. 
So 12, which is how many blocks Miss Washington had, minus 9, which is how many blocks Aiden has, equals 3. So Miss Washington has 3 more blocks than Aiden. And even though this problem is set up a little different, we can still do a number bond because we still have our number sentence that we're used to. So make your number bond and I'll be waiting for you guys. Okay, <laughs> hopefully you have your number bond ready to get started. So what is the whole? If you said 12, that's correct. And then for the two parts, we have nine and three. We have 12 for our whole, nine for our parts, and three for our other parts. So even though our problem looked a little different, it was still subtraction, and we were able to still put it into a number bond. So thank you guys for another CGI problem with Ms. Washington, and I will see you guys tomorrow.